I mean, it'll make you, it'll make me, honestly, I can't 100% say, but I would rather be less mad because you took ownership of what you did versus being mad at you because of what you did and the fact that you lied about you doing it. And then being mad at the fact that you're an adult picking a childish way to try to get out of doing something, get out of taking responsibility. That's crazy as hell. No. I mean, if I did something, yeah, I did it. Not in the attitude type where I'm like, yeah, I messed something up. Let me, uh, I'm in the process of fixing it or cleaning it up or whatever. But no. Yeah, uh, people just lie. The second thing, for no reason at that, uh, see, I said I didn't want to forget what the second thing was and I still forgot. But yeah, Let's see if I remember what the hell the second thing was that bothers me. Oh, the second thing is, I think it was when somebody can sit around the house or somebody not even around the house. How can you just, me, this me personally, how can you just not bathe for months, day, we'll start off with days on end, we, which lead to weeks on end and out, then goes into months, then years. When you get to the end of 12 months, that's all damn year. You ain't took a bath in a whole year? Like a proper bath? I don't, personally, I don't claim a whole, I don't call a whore bath or throwing, cocking your leg up on the sink and throwing water on your nether regions a bath. That's not a bath. Birds only take bird baths because that's the only bath that they can take. And they can't use soap because that's going to weigh them down or whatnot, in my mind. But my thing is, okay, why are you... I can't just be around somebody who just, they stink and they know they stink. Well, should I say stink? They stink and they know they stink and they're not doing anything about it. They act like they just don't smell anything. Like, what? How do you not smell anything? How can you just constantly plop down on the couch and all that ass air, hot ass air coming up from your ass, hitting everybody in their face? You can't smell that? I mean... One thing stuck with me out of my elementary school years, and we had this one teacher that would always say, you smell your, you can smell yourself before somebody else do. But some people, either their nose don't work properly, or their senses are off or something, or they just trying to fool themselves. They smell like something, they just want to, they think if they ignore it, it'll go away. I'm like, what the hell? No, they said it's not going to go away until you take a bath and use some soap. Like, actually get in the tub, use some soap. And then you should be able to tell when your skin is turning different colors that it's been a while since the last time you took a bath. And then my thing is, with the teeth, and when you don't brush your teeth, how can you sit there and talk to somebody in their face? How can you kiss somebody and your teeth got stains on it? Like, how? I don't understand how that's supposed to work. I don't understand how you don't smell yourself. Like, this person actually sit there and blow their breath in their hands and act like they don't smell nothing. I'm like, damn, what is wrong with your nose? Like, you don't, you literally don't sit there and blow your own breath in your hand and don't smell nothing. Like, you literally don't smell anything. Just like you don't smell anything went wrong with your body. Like, you turn in different colors and you don't see that? You don't smell that? You don't smell it when you sit down? When you plop down all that hot, stanky, uh, hot little bald ass smell that comes up and hit everybody?